Welcome to the Michigan Travel Show, a kaleidoscope of stories about the people, places, and events that shape our great state. Its first university, the University of St. Andrews, a leader from its beginning. The volunteer shows a bold adventure, and staff and students today continue in the forward-looking and innovative spirit of the university's founders. So, here's a map of Europe, universities, whatever this is, half Y St. Andrews, largest cathedral, uh, library, started at like University in 1410, clergy here, the symbol, one of their flags they put up. Mm -hmm. And all the ceremonial graduation sticks here. Things they do during summer, like the ocean swim. Ah, uh, sitting on the cold stone. They were questioned by the Silver. The first left women in. That's what the cathedral looks like. Dressing the part. Uh, crazy outfits. When you're a freshman to a senior. Different robes they wear. Lots of ceremonial stuff here. Here, this is the Wardlow Museum. Inquiring minds, uh, like all universities, looking to investigate what the world is around them. Different plants, animals, bugs, the art of and science. Variety of things here, human body, the brain. Intestines, the eyeball, what do I see? Optical illusions, taxi phones, invisible forces interact with natural causes, phenomena. See on the wind, electricity, the sun, time, how they all interact. Here, the natural world of animals, plants. Rocks, matter, 3D. Over here, chemistry, as we can see, energy, chemistry, astronomy. Of course, they were always fighting the, the church reformers. Uh, Photography of St. Andrews, paintings. It's kind of a history of St. Andrews itself. The globes, some of their professors encountering cultures, like some objects from around the world, expanding horizons, art. There, how comes the different artworks? Once again, astronomy here, the wind, stars, the ocean, how they all interact. And here, natural specimens that are saved, other than dinosaurs. This is the Albany Gallery. It says Iran, wonders of thy natures. Iran, it's an Iranian collection here. You know, there's lots of places in Iran that are beautiful. The Iranian gardens, Cyprus to Great. The 
land and you share purpose, you shape our peoples in the dead center of the Middle East. Other artifacts from Iran. I said, I heard it's beautiful over there. The power of nature, heroes and beasts. Astrological tables. The study of the earth and sciences and everything else in between, the skies, the order of the universe, cosmology, the universe is ordered, astronomy, and the time of butterflies. This about the butterfly. Parisian poetry, the butterfly, denotes a moment that is particularly beautiful, yet also fleeting, always carrying within it the idea of sacrifice when magically drawn to the light, it flies to its doom. Yeah, kind of interesting. Okay, we're up here at this museum, and this is the view we get up here on the third floor. There's the beaches. All the rocky shore kind of ends at the beach there and uh, there's the golf course I heard the 18th hole and then the coastline just keeps going up where it's all sand it's amazing it's all rocky here and then the sand hits right there and it's sandy all the rest of the way and the waves are coming in that is pretty cool wow we absolutely gorgeous well, this is what I just went through the Ward Law Museum. It's the University of St. Andrews. It's kind of the history and what uh, goes on with the university. This university was started in 1413, and there's their museum building. And uh, truly, it was a nice museum of uh, what it is, what uh, St. Andrews University is about. So, um, nice educational thing, uh, and to find out about this. Uh, interesting university and unique place on this planet and like i said uh the statue right out in front so this is obviously a unique place in the world so it's great to come here and see all the different things i've seen in just the last few hours